So uh, these are the general terms uh, that we are talking about in op operations on events. Uh, then we have to mention something else, and this is called a complementary event. A complementary event and mutually exclusive events. The complementary event is an event that complements the uh, event concerned, the event that we're talking about. To explain this more, let's say uh, we have our sample set, the big sample set S, and we have the event a, inside S. So A represents this part of S. Still, we have this bigger part that um, that's included in here. And obviously, we can notice that if we add this part to this part, it will give us the sample set S. So, we refer to this part as the complementary event of A. So we refer to it as A dash. We can um, conclude from this that an event plus its complementary event yields the sample set. Or in other words, the sample set negative the event gives its complementary event. Or the sample set negative the complementary event gives the event. So that was our first term here. The second one is mutually exclusive events. Mutually exclusive events. Simply, these uh, mutually exclusive events doesn't intersect. Or in other words, if we have the two events A and B, so A intersection B actually equals phi. And we can draw this um, like that. This is S. This will be A and this will be B. There's no intersection between the two events. All of the explanation and drawings that we are doing here is called uh, Venn diagramming. Venn diagrams. So all of these are called Venn diagrams. These are used to uh, facilitate explaining the relations between events and statistics. So that was our lesson today. Hope it was clear and see you next time.